Honorable Deputy Chairman, sir, I only supplement whatever my colleague Sri Jayamara Mahesh has said. The basic question is this act is amended, section 2, it extends to the whole of India. Earlier, the act says, this act is applicable to whole of India except Jammu and Kashmir. Now, with a small proviso, you are trying to extend this act to Jammu and Kashmir. As everybody in the house is unanimous, the consent of the Jammu and Kashmir Assembly and also the Jammu and Kashmir government is necessary. Otherwise, it affects Article 370 of the Constitution. To that extent, we are opposed to this. Unless you will, it is not right on the part of any one of us to meddle with the Constitution, Article 370, and in whatever manner you want to do it, it is not correct. We sincerely request the Honorable Minister to explain as to in, under what circumstances you want to do this, why you want to meddle with Article 370. So number two, the, this information collected, there is another significant change. The significant change is the data collected so far has to be used only for government purposes. It cannot be given to anybody else. Now by this amendment, the bill seeks to amend section 9. The static of statics officer or any person or agency authorized under this act shall be a statistical purpose use any information furnished under section 6 in such manner as may be prescribed. We don't know how the government is going to prescribe because this rule making power sometimes can be misused. The act is not clear what are the, how this agency is going to share the data to whom it is at least a broad sharing to which agency they want to share or how they want to use as rightly said by most of your colleagues, the government of the day, the political party of the day, misuse the data collected in whatever manner they want to misuse. And this provision, we are giving that power to the government to, to do whatever they want by, by way of rules, which is not acceptable, sir. The third point is appointment of nodal officer. The appointment of nodal officer, yes, we agree there is, should be nodal officers. But the powers are not defined in the act. You see, the, this is always the, the we, after all, nodal, either you should not say that nodal officer has, has no other power except liaison. But if you are giving any power to any authority, it should be debated in the parliament and what power you are going to be defined. Giving power, we cannot leave it to the rules, the government to make the rules for creating, giving power to whomsoever they like. So these are the three basic uh, objections. The nodal officer's power has to be defined in the act. Otherwise, it will be misused. He, will, he can go anywhere, he can share anywhere, he can uh, ask anybody to do whatever they like. He, he, he may, he may create problems also, nodal officer. So the powers of the node, nodal officer has to be defined in the act itself. The information sharing agency to whom what purpose the information is shared, whom, which are the agencies. Which are the agencies you want to share, to you? even foreign agencies or any, anybody's agencies or your own agencies? This is not defined. Then as far as Article 370 is concerned, if there is no concurrence, because simultaneously, it is our, my opinion, that simultaneously, the, when they have a parallel act, that they should make, this provision should be included in that act also. With this, I uh, thank you for giving me this. Thank you very much. Now, Sri Vigar.